What's next I that sky. say it's what's going on. It's gotten worse over the last 24 hours. Like I'm having... Like I'm not... Like I'm not well at all. I haven't been for a long time... For a while now and... Since I could comes home, it just, just, just the declining, the declining health had rapidly accelerated. And since I could got home, so unfortunately, there's nothing that can be done to fix it now. Everything that had been that had been attempted uh, just proved to be too unsuccessful. later on for it anywhere. So that's... <clears throat> I mean, there's not really much going on around here, as you can see, because of the fact that, well, I'm still unwell from what happened. very unfortunate but things are not looking too good for me. <clears throat> so yeah, we're gonna have to get someone to do this yard for us. Because we'll be unable to do it. Um, 
because of the fact that Psychonet's going to be completely immobilized for two weeks. And I, well, I'm already in enough health pro- I already have enough health problems as it is. And I'm already very unwell anyways. I mean, I can get around no problem. It's just having to work a lot is the problem. Let's go. Let's go pick it up. There's more. It's blowing powerful gales out here. Aha. Uh-huh. You go. There's some goons up there. Tried to do something. I don't know what they tried to do. They tried to do something. Alright. Yeah, there's nothing in the mailbox. They just decided to just trick me. I'm just unwell. I mean, I almost lost me balance. Oh, like I almost lost me balance just a little earlier on. I was so dizzy. Later. Okay, Islanders, and look who look who came back, Uncle Thomas. Hey, Islanders. Oh, shit. Uncle Thomas is watching the 9/11 anniversary episode. Twenty years since 9/11, and it's the 21st of September. So obviously that was t- ten episodes ago. It's now episode 475. It makes it look like you just woke up, Uncle Thomas. I did. I woke up and I was going to sit outside. I was going to sit out there outside my room and on my little living room and watch TV. And I kept stepping on uh, broken chips and pieces of like chips and pop bottle caps and I'm uh, like yeah. nope screw it. I'm like heck with this so I grab my cabinet and drug it back in here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So like that that they're, they're not they're not gonna listen, then I'm gonna have to do something about it. If they don't listen, <laughs> then that's it. <laughs> Plus I miss laying down watching T V too, so Oh uh, yes, well I've actually got the TV in my office as well. But how's Michael Dad doing? Yeah, he's lay- he's obviously laying down. He's going to be pretty much laying down for a, a long time for the next two weeks. Yeah, of course I can, Uncle Thomas. Um, so, yeah, so... 
I actually noticed quite a bit of difference with Psycho Dad. Really? Yeah. He's actually... He's actually... Yeah, he's... He, do, he doesn't get up to use the bathroom much as much as he used to. Because I remember how he used to get up every every two hours or so. Now it's only every three, three to like every three or four hours. <gasps> so it looks, so it looks like it actually did him the trick. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching this episode of Island Life. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you Islanders in the next episode. Goodbye. And, of course, from Uncle Thomas himself. Goodbye. Mmm.